the picture of a tree and each tries to understand different concept that comes in the process of understanding a conflict. First of all, if there is a conflict, there should be a cause. It's like uh, if there is smoke, you can see that there should be a fire. So it's just like there should be a cause for any conflict. So this tree can be symbolized just to understand that the concept of conflict. Just like the root can be seen as a cause. And when this root it grows, well the problem becomes smaller and more bigger. And it, the when there is fruit and it grows up, it comes as an effect. You know, sometimes most of our problems it does not is not known by many people. It is there within us. But only when it becomes a bigger problem and it starts uh, growing up and many people come to know because they see the effect of what is happening within us. So, so that is the way we try to understand the, uh, the, the problems. And after understanding the problems, well, there are, there are some uh, funny ways of explaining how each problem can be solved and how different people when they encounter problems, they are trying to uh, solve the problems. There are different ways. For example, we can uh, take like a donkey. Well, when there is a problem in the community, they are so stubborn. You know, even if you tell to them several things, you know, <laughs> they are like, like just like a monkey. <laughs> they don't understand. Hard yeah, they are very hard-hearted. They don't understand uh, what we are trying to say and they are so stubborn and they don't want to change. And some are like elephants. You know, when there is a problem and we try to uh, we, we try to solve that problem but then they, they block it just like an elephant you can block the way and they block the whole situation or the whole process of solving the problem and sometimes uh, some people can be like a lion when they encounter problems you know their lion is always trying to dominate they want to dominate and they say that okay what I say is right and uh, so in that way also is possible and sometimes like a rabbit I don't want to face it, I just run away because uh, I know that there is some, I sense some kind of danger there so better don't remain there to run away from the situation and uh, some are, sometimes we try to solve the problem like ostrich you know ostrich we try to hide ourselves from the problems and uh, we put our head down and we feel that nobody else sees the problem but the problem still remains there that does not in fact solve the problem and sometimes like uh, turtle we just withdraw uh, that is a problem I don't want to get into that struggle it's too difficult for me let them solve it I don't want to so it's a kind of uh, just withdrawal then like a chameleon chameleon how to say that? chameleon chameleon yeah uh, that's like changing the color uh, when each situation, you know, I say one to him, and I go there, I, I tell another thing to him. I try to, you know, satisfy like everyone. The, like the communist. The yeah, Vietnam, exactly. The Vietnam, the communist. Yeah. <laughs> but it does not actually solve the problem. It only aggravates the problem because uh, we are not trying to address. I try to uh, just make him happy, and I go there, and I also try to make him happy, right. but then uh, that, that is not a... Uh, problem solution or sometimes like we are like all and we pretend that everything is okay and we are very so confident until nothing happens we just remain there uh, and uh, sometimes like a mouse is so timid I just, I just want to I, I don't want to encounter that so I just uh, just like rabbit I just uh, run away and sometimes like a uh, monkey and we jump around and go around and we make full fooling the people and we make them, make them uh, in fact complicate the situation and in fact that also does not solve the problem but these are just a kind of uh, taking the behavior of certain animals and we apply it to human behavior how we try to solve the problems but then that in that way we cannot anyway solve the problems but there are some professional way of solving that is when there is a problem we try to accommodate it. Well, there is 
problem is there. We have to accept that. And we try to uh, accommodate that problem and try to solve seeing the different perspective of the people uh, involved in it. So in that way, there is a, some people try to do, uh, solve the problem by accommodating. Maybe one need to sacrifice. Maybe I have a different idea of solving that problem, but then I realize that there is a better way of understanding it. So I try to accommodate the views of the others, and I try to solve the problem. And sometimes I can be like competing. You know, I just want to uh, force people to receive my ideas because I believe that my ideas are better than the others. So I just want to show that my views and everything is fine, and you just listen to me. And the other way of uh, avoiding, I know that you are not going to listen to me, so better <laughs> it's just no, uh, just leave it. And I don't want to solve that problem. And and I, I see that better way is collaborating. And if we collaborate with everyone and take the good things of every uh, everyone involved in that problem, maybe there may be only two people, sit together and listen. And when, they, when you listen, definitely you will know that there are something which you thought was bad. But then when he told me that, oh, there is a better way of doing that, and I also understand. Oh, okay, we can do it in that way. So there is a mutual collaboration to solve the problem. So that could be the better way of uh, uh, solving a problem in a community life. Then there is also compromising. Uh, I can also, I just listen to the others. And others, they make the, pro, there is a problem, and others make some solutions, and I just compromise. Okay. So, but I don't say that all this, any of this uh, style of uh, solving the problems are perfect. Now, each has got its own uh, problems and uh, uh, difficulties. So, but for me, when we are in a community, well, we cannot avoid the problem. Probably, there will be problems in the community. So, we also cannot uh, just accommodate whatever they say, and I just don't want to involve in that one. We also cannot uh, be like that. But it, it also depends on the personality of each person. You know, some people that really don't want to enter into uh, that one. So, you know, for me, my personality is so something that I try to, I don't, I try to go more with accommodating and compromising. Yeah, it depends on the personalities. Uh, so, but for me, I know that the better way of solving the problem is collaborating.